so hello there guys this is dr emmanuel and uh today i'm going to be showing you exactly how to install pc drivers for free pc drivers for free for any personal computer running windows of any version yeah of any year so this method is quite easy yeah it's very easy all you need is your laptop that is broken with no drivers and a wi-fi connection an active one yeah and uh, the laptop I, uh, the laptop i'm using for this is a lenovo thinkpad though not th not thinkpad yoga 11e but thinkpad so uh this one is currently on windows and key which i'm going to be reviewing in my next video i'm sure this is a version of windows that probably is new to you yeah because if you check on my icons right here they are quite different you know, the, the the recycle bin here is quite alien yeah so uh my laptop here is quite running running quite well so i'm not going to be installing any drivers but i'm going to give you the tutorial that works for any any windows pc that has a problem so every time your laptop has a problem probably the touch has stopped working probably the keyboard is not working well yeah probably when you press five yeah the thing what gets typed on the screen is probably j or something like the keyboard is inverted or something yeah uh it's very easy what you're gonna do is go to the manufacturer's website because the manufacturer knows the best uh, ever specifications and the best ever drivers equipped for your laptop specifically so uh the the method is quite easy as i said so let's get let's get to it what you're gonna do because this is a lenovo i'm just going to go to lenovo website so i'm just gonna type lenovo dot com no wait i'll start with support support dot lenovo dot com yeah and then you hit enter and uh, there we go let that load I don't know why it's taking years to load or something. Okay. Mm -hmm. I think it's Firefox that's slow. I should have used Chrome probably. Should I switch to Chrome? No. I just deal with this. So once you are in here in Lenovo website, or let me say you are in your iLife website, maybe Acer, maybe HP, whichever laptop you're using just gonna come here to support now for lenovo the arrangement is easy you find here pc data center mobile which is lenovo or motorola smart and some other service parts okay now we are not going for service parts here right now we are dealing with drivers and i'm gonna just hit pc and this is taking years to load Guys, should I change to Chrome or something? I just wait for this. Yeah. So we have PC technical support, okay? Now what you're gonna do? Yeah, we have EG ThinkPad, T blah blah, 1100E Chromebook. Now you're not, you're not using any 100Es or anything. So yeah, we want the we want it to detect our product. Yeah. Mm let me see or detecting product will take time it will prompt us to download the lenovo service bridge which will then be used to detect the product but right now we don't have the time and my pc is not it's not slow it's not like missing any drivers so i'm just i just want to show you guys uh probably if you are product, products on the list let's hit here let's browse and uh right now we're dealing with the laptop yeah, we're gonna check select series here. Yeah. Mm. Let's say we were dealing with mm. which one can I use? Lenovo idea pad. Let's choose that. Select uh, let's say your laptop here. The mystery laptop is idea about this. Yeah. Wait for that to load. Mm. 
and there we are so this is how it will display for you and then you'll come here and find we have our product home driver software diagnostics knowledge based and guides warranty and services repair status and all the stuff that are there okay you have update my system you have help me with software my device isn't working properly but what you're gonna do because you need drivers you just come here and drivers and software and click on that let it load now because uh we have a uh, this is an automatic this is an automatic thing it will happen automatically and online just come here and choose automatic update but if you want you can do manual update also not too bad yeah not too bad in this case you'll input a, a driver name and then you'll search but that would be so 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 much crazy man so i usually go with the automatic update after this you run a smart scan so when you run this smart scan it will detect the drivers you have and the ones you don't have so let me see i don't know if i can run smart scan this yet the name i chose there was quite different let's see now it's prompting me to download lenovo service bridge the one i told you about let's see what, what what's going on to happen so guys uh i had downloaded this let me show you how lenovo service bridge looks yeah and there it is there so i'm not going to download it again but uh once you're through with this the downloading of this service bridge let's let's assume your mystery machine is uh, lenovo once you're through downloading this service bridge yeah the the, the the website will be able to detect your machine detect the software that are missing then after that you'll be given a list of the ones which are missing and the options to download them and then you'll go ahead and download them let's let's try and see if this one will work for us eh? I just hit download and see mm -hmm. yeah save the file let's save it mm, i'm not seeing any download going on probably i'm not checking well let's see completed mm -hmm. let's open it let's run as administrator i think it's running in background or something let's come back to firefox in our website here and uh, try again running the scan So this can be a very much tedious process very very much tedious but uh you have to be very very much patient because you need your machine to be fixed you don't want to spend some hundred dollars yeah on uh, some hooker or some broker who is selling software at high prices yeah this one could help you save a lot a lot of cash diy now let's wait for that forever loading thing to load and then we can get back to it so uh, again guys if you're wondering why the version of windows i'm using is different it's windows nt as i said and uh i'm going to be reviewing windows nt in my next video stay tuned yeah this is taking forever i don't know let's switch, let's switch to man manual updates so i can you can get over with this i don't want to keep you guys here all day watching a video let's come to manual update here so let's say the driver i need is uh bios bios upgrade yeah or maybe you need hid touch screen maybe you need uh something and here it is just hit that so because this is what you want you want this bios thing yeah here it is you wanted a bios update for your windows 64 bit you just come here and uh, what do you do you hit download download button so i'm going to hit this and then i'm gonna stop it stop it because my bios is running pretty well let's just hit that to confirm that it's really really downloading and there it is yeah but for now i'm not going to download it because my laptop is running well so guys yeah that's exactly how you do it 
even if you go to let's say hp support.hp dot hp dot com hit enter let's see how it runs you let packard and if you're wondering installing drivers is very very easy what you'll just have to do is go to let me show you that one first before i show you the hp one just come here to your files and uh come to your downloads like here now i'm, I'm in my downloads locate the driver image it will be saved here as some kind of a, an image or a disk image or a zip file if it's a zip file kindly kindly make sure you unzip it to find the, the the install installation directory so you'll come here and locate your file right click and run as administrator it's that easy then after a restart after a reboot your computer will be now well equipped with the drivers you need yeah so even for hp let me say i accept all this you just come here as software and drivers yeah hit that to load I don't know what this is, uh, hanging window here is all about. Just wait for this forever loading thing to load. I don't know. My Wi-Fi is having some kind of a problem. Maybe I should fix. See, let's identify your product to get started. It's a laptop, desktop, and all this. So, downloading driver is very easy. So, don't go around paying uh, too much cash. If you have Wi-Fi and uh, you have uh, your laptop there, well... I'd rather you do it yourself but also if you're someone who is sedentary and maybe wants to get things done pretty quick then go ahead and buy after all what has what what are how hookers and bro, brokers for to help you save time by bringing things to your doorstep so that was it for this video guys make sure you check out my youtube channel yeah I have a whole playlist on uh, how to make money, so I'm going to be leaving the link down in the description below. Make sure you check it out. Make sure you hit the subscribe button. Just come here and search Hello Tech. Yeah, enter. And uh, here's my here's my channel. Just hit that. And these are my videos. You can just check any of them and make sure you subscribe yeah and we we'll see you guys next time